Yeah, I came in with a saw. Ooh, yeah, I came in with a saw. Yeah, bitch, I flare red raw. Yeah, bitch, I flare red raw. Yeah. What's up, YouTube? It's Boy View. It's bringing as a first top 10 of the year and i went through guys submissions and got the best 10 clips that i thought were worthy enough so here they are and in case you guys are new to the channel and haven't seen one before on 2k17 i just put the clips in no specific order and i let you guys decide which one is number one so yeah all these clips no order except for number one probably that's like my opinion but i want you guys to tell me which one you thought was the best one and leave a comment down below after you don't watch the video but yeah this video is way long overdue because i promised you guys i'd have it up friday and it's already wednesday and i'm really sorry about that guys but it's only because i had to go back to houston and i left my pc and my setup here in uh college so yeah, i had no way of posting any videos but i'm back and yeah i'm sure you guys are excited for this top 10 because a bunch of you have been asking for it so here it is and without wasting more time let's get right into it so coming at the number 10 spot we got hero brian sun and as you guys can see it's not really a familiar spot at the playground but it's the dunk contest it's kind of whenever you spawn it but he's just doing a few windmills and you have to time it if you guys didn't know because the first time i did it i was breaking every single one but he's just getting a few um dunks in look at the score it's pretty high but the shot clock's about to wind down so he's gonna go for one more and that shit happens a missed green bean dunk and when i was first looking at this clip i really didn't see what the whole big deal was i thought he was gonna do like a special dunk or something but nope it was 2k being broken like always but yeah just take a look at it again he's getting constant greens and he's getting a few yellow ones on the line but of course it had to be the last one and he probably would have kept going for days but he misses the green and just the perfect example as to why 2k is broke as hell at the number nine spot we got xpc 907 i think that was his name 703 we have his teammates saucing up his dude, but he's gonna end up passing it to him. And he's gonna chunk up a shot, brick, and ma! The first ever self pullback I've ever seen on this game. And of course, it had to be a nasty ass windmill, too. But yeah, just take a look at it again. He didn't even get a running star at all, but he obviously didn't need one because he just took flight and just made up for his broken shot. Moving on to the number 8 spot, we got Toronto 416, and he's not the guy recording it, but he's still going to come down the court with the ball and throw it over the backboard for the clean-ass alley-oop, and I still don't know if this was supposed to be part of the game or, like, what's supposed to happen, but it honestly looked like it because it went straight over the backboard to his teammate, and he didn't even fumble it or anything. It went straight to his hand. So, yeah, let me know if you guys ever got this before or have ever even seen it besides this time because... If 2k actually put this in the game then props to them because this shit was badass at the number seven spot we got z wolf pack and his team is going to come down the court with them give them the ball for the disgusting ass windmill double contact dunk and if you guys didn't peep that i'll show it one more time just look at this dude when he comes down he sort of just rolls on his back and kicks the dude and brings him to the floor as well just for being in the way but one more time windmill kills that dude then kicks this guy's ass and drops him as well and i have yet to see a triple contact dunk just saying so if you guys have got that send it in and it'll definitely make the top 10. at number six we got hjb 127 coming down with the board and just taking it up the court and you think he's just gonna go up with the layup but no he's gonna throw a lob bang mid air alley-oop and then his teammate just finishes it off with the between the legs over his defender i don't know if you guys saw that or not but he easily clears it right over his head for game point two and yeah, this is easily the best alley I've seen all year. And the only one I could think of that would be better is if it was a double lob. But until then, this one is definitely the best one I've seen all year. At the number five spot, we got Quaidon Pass. And he's a center, but he wants to ball. So we're just going to put this guy in the post. I think it's uh, Channing Fry. That's his name. But yeah, backing him down, as you can see, he's way bigger. And he's a 7-3 center, if you guys haven't noticed. But yeah, shot clock's winding down. Just posting him up a little bit. And he's going to give him a little hesitation to drop him i don't even think he has ankle breaker on bronze i'm pretty sure he does it but as you guys can clearly see ankle breaker on the top right and just drops his ass with a little ass hesitation a center breaking ankles and then just finishes it off with the easy layup and yeah looking back at it i think it's a little half spin you can call it not even a hesitation he does a little half spin and just drops him 
So yeah, I don't know if you can do this in the park, but you can clearly do it in the game. And it's just a matter of time until someone actually does it in the park. And this game becomes even more broke. Moving on to number four, we got Modern Sniper and he's broaching, but he's gonna pick the ball and push this dude to the floor. And if you guys haven't seen this, it's because it's brand new this year and that's honestly so nasty and disrespectful, but God, that's honestly really cool that they put that in the game because I don't know if you need your strength up to do that or if it's just a random animation, but dude, he literally clearly pushes his ass to the floor. No foul called. And then he finishes it off with the self balance windmill. So yeah, that's a nasty ass play by Modern Sniper. And also guys, forgot to mention, but just like every other top 10, I'm gonna have everyone's link in the description for those that have YouTube channels. And for those that don't, I'll still find a way to shout them out. So yeah, go check them out after the video if you have time and just show them love because they honestly do deserve support for these nasty ass clips. At the number three spot, we got Frank Jennings and he's a center, but he's reaching on the court and he's trying to get back, but he's just gonna bang literally grab the ball from the top of the backboard and snatch block it. i don't even know if you call it a snatch he just straight grabbed it with both hands and i think this has been done in the nba i'm not sure snatch blocks have been done with one hand and stuff and like out the air but i don't know about just straight palming it two hands while he's in the glass but god this was really put in because of how high he jumped i'm pretty sure it was a glitch because of my career but still look how high he jumped top of the backboard fingertips clearly touching it so yeah good shit dude and if you're on ps4 please hit me up because i need center to run with moving on to number two we got go hard bro and he's playing defense guys dribbling through his body so he's gonna get the rip go right skirt left Ma! made his guy pray and i'm not sure if this is the exact same animation as 2k 16 and 17 because I know they had a prayer animation then, but I don't know if this one's any different. I'll try to see and look at all the videos, but this was the first time I've seen this dunk. And of all the submissions, this is the only one. So that's why I put it because I based the clips off how rare it is and how just insane it is in general. And yeah, I'm sure all you guys can agree that this one deserved to spawn in the top 10. And then also look at the dude who got dunked on. He just like gets mad at nothing, but fuck, I would have quit if I was him. Number one. So I guess... I was lying when I said I was going to pick number one as my opinion, but honestly, I couldn't decide which one I thought was the best. So all these clips are in no specific order, not even number one. So I need your guys' help to tell me which one you thought was the best because I honestly have no idea. So yeah, not necessarily the best clip, but just at the number one spot, we got Innocence and he's going to get the ball inbounded to him, do a little dribble move, snatch back, drop, and then the center is going to drop his dude as well. Trying to catch himself. But I've seen this once last year. And it was also on the twos. And I really don't know if I should call this a double ankle breaker. But I don't know what else to call it honestly. Because he clearly broke this dude's ankles. And then he just brings his teammate as well to the floor. For the double ankle breaker. And yeah, just take a look at it again. Because I guess it is pretty realistic. Because say you were to get dropped. And you were just falling backwards. You never know, you could make your teammate fall with you if you didn't see him or if he didn't see you. But yeah, there goes that version of the double anchor breaker. And I still have yet to see an actual one where it's one move and two people fall at the same time. So if you've got one of those, send it in and it'll definitely make it as long as you finish. Because if you don't finish, there's no point to play. But yeah, guys, that's basically it for this video. Hope you all enjoyed. And as always, if you want to send in a clip, all you have to do is upload it to YouTube as unlisted. And send me the link to viewwits10 at gmail.com. And I promise to look at all the clips. And if you sent your clip, uh, I want to say like five days ago up till now, I probably didn't look at it because I got enough clips before I got to yours. So don't worry. I'm going to look at those clips first up to the newest ones, if you know what I mean. So there's not one video left out because I really do promise to look at all of them. And the faster I get clips, the faster I upload the top 10. So yeah, I'll try to have it up next Friday or next Wednesday. It depends how fast I get the clips. But if you guys did enjoy the video, please drop a like. And if you're new to the channel, drop a sub if you enjoyed the content. And if you're one of the people who made the top 10, comment down below to let everyone know. And also so I can congratulate you and maybe drop a sub, you never know. But yeah, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. <gasps> oh my God.